Hello Sagittarius, welcome to your July 2023 audio telescope brought to you by me Kathleen Robinson of Karma Queen, the Yorkshire Tarot and Five Tarot. And if you would like to have a tarot card reading with me, then contact me at karmaqueens at gmail.com. So let's get back to you Sagittarius. This month you've been brought the Queen of Rods reversed and the message here, it's time to chillax and just let go. Because the Queen of Rods reverse can describe a situation in which somebody is behaving in a manipulative or pushy or selfish way. Somebody can be demanding, controlling, petting, narrow-minded. And it indicates that you've recently lost your confidence in yourself and maybe have become a shrinking violet. What you need to do is restore faith and belief in yourself. And it, it describes a situation in which someone is behaving in a manipulative way. You may be stressed and find yourself letting others down. Jealousy may be on the surface and perhaps you're blowing hot and cold and can't seem to motivate yourself. One of you seems to be in a chronically bad mood if you're in a relationship and is angry, resentful and jealous. So time has come to chill and let go. And perhaps you're being too harsh and causing yourself more work from being too demanding. So as far as your work goes, there may be a frustrating obstacles and delays that you will be up against. It's important not to take them personally, just work through them one moment at a time. And there may be an older, light-haired woman in the workplace who is in a position of authority, who's throwing up obstacles. Don't get frustrated about it. Just show her the rational reasons why she needs to do things your way. Do this and you could be more successful than you imagine. In terms of love, it could be that an older light-haired woman could be involved indirectly in your relationship. If she's your mother-in-law, do your best to make her an ally, regardless of how you feel about her. And if you're looking for love, you could well meet a very interesting potential partner through an older woman. Let the woman in your life know if you're looking to meet someone new. Financially, it can indicate a net tendency to overdo it with regard to expenditures. There's a reason why people say money can't buy you happiness. At the same time, there's no need for you to go to the other extreme and refuse to spend any money whatsoever. Moderation is the key to use your financials well and it won't put you wrong. So that's all from me. Until the next time, take care.